touchdown for South Africa's head of state. As the BRICS grouping hopes to build on the successful hosting of the annual summit in Johannesburg last year, that continues the strong economic and multilateral focus that has been a hallmark of these gatherings. The BRICS countries will continue to maintain global order by building a multilateral system that is rule-based. By global governance, we can build a world that is more orderly. Brazil's theme expands on that of last year's one of inclusive growth in the fourth industrial revolution to economic growth pegged on innovation, a focus on fighting transnational crime, inclusive health care, trade and investment and public-private partnerships with the BRICS Business Forum also due to conclude later Wednesday. The cooperation between BRICS countries have achieved remarkable success in building new cooperation and development mechanisms. It will help the convergence of our economies and create job opportunities and incomes for our people, which will prompt the share of growth for us all. Ahead of the heads of state and government segment, BRICS foreign ministers met to chart the way forward. It is my sincere wish that our partnership will continue to challenge the status quo where it is not benefiting the masses of our people. President Ramaphosa will address the BRICS Business Forum at its conclusion later Wednesday. There will surely be a sense of familiarity in the room when BRICS leaders meet later Wednesday, but also an elephant in that room. Perhaps a small one in the likes of Brazil's president and summit host Jair Bolsonaro, who has vastly shifted Brazil's politics to the right as he has sought closer ties with the United States under President Donald Trump. They both, for example, believe that global warming or climate change is a hoax while the nationalist government of India under Narendra Modi has also sought closer ties with Washington, raising pertinent questions about the future of BRICS in a world of shifting global political allegiances. Sherman Bryceby's SABC News, Brasilia, Brazil.